evaporation and condensation is happening all around us all the time. Evaporation is the change of a liquid into a gas. Let's look at some everyday examples of evaporation. Ironing a damp cloth. Have you ever tried ironing a damp cloth? The damp cloth becomes dry as the hot iron evaporates the water in the clothing. Using a hand sanitizer. Alcohol present in the hand sanitizer evaporates faster than water. You apply hand sanitizer on your hands and in less than 30 seconds it's gone. Blow drying of hair. When you blow dry your hair using hot air released by hair dryer, your wet hair becomes dry within minutes. Drying of a wet surface. Wipe a table or any other surface with a wet sponge. After some time, it becomes dry as water evaporates. Drying of a mopped floor. A similar example is drying of a wet floor on its own after mopping if you leave it for a few minutes. Drying of clothes. Wet clothes hanged on a clothesline become dry after few hours under the sun. Drying of sweat. We sweat to cool down. That's our body's mechanism. Water leaves through our skin through pores and when you sit under a fan, it evaporates on its own. Condensation is the process where water vapor becomes liquid. Some common examples of condensation are cloud formation. Just look up at the sky. Clouds are formed as a result of water vapor cooling in atmosphere. Fog. It's not always necessary for water vapors to go up to become a cloud. Sometimes in very humid conditions, they condense above the earth's surface as fog. Visible breath. You can at times see your breath during winter season as clouds coming out of your mouth. This happens when moist and warm air from our mouth hits cold air from outside. Moisture on car windows. When the warm air inside the heated car comes in contact with the window which is cold due to outside temperature, beads of water are formed. Clouding of eye glasses. You become visually impaired for some time if you get out of your AC car into a warmer environment as the warm outside air touches your cold glasses. Fogging of mirror. You must have noticed fogging of mirror when you are taking a hot shower. You can write on it or need to wipe it to see yourself. Water drops on the glass. If your glass contains any ice-cold beverage or water, you will see tiny water drops outside your glass as the warmer outside air hits the cold surface of glass. Dew on the leaves. Have you ever wondered why there are drops of water on the leaves in the morning when it didn't rain? The air near the ground, which is still warmer at night, touches the colder leaves then it settles as dew.